I love you, my darling. You have nothing to worry about. Your heart will weigh less than a feather, just as Mart requires. And then your soul will find its holy way to Osiris, just as pure as when you came into the world. And then, my darling Catherine, you and I will be together forever in the afterlife. I want that too. I knew you'd understand. I didn't know that I'd hurt you so badly, Paul. Please give me another chance. Now that I know how much you love me, how could I ever not be with you? I do, my darling. I love you so much. Now that I know that, everything will be different. We can be together in this life. If that's what you want, my darling. I will I'll, I'll never see Robin again. I just, I just want to be. You shall have it, my darling. We will be together. Forever. Did Cindy get hold of you? Yes, yeah, she called in last night looking for you. But she said she had something on Victor. No, she didn't tell me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What a little story. Oh, what do you want to bring her here for? Um, well, you're going to have to come in the back way. We've got all these reporters. Yeah. All right, see you in a bit. Bye. I got Robin off to school, right? Good. I don't know what all those damn reporters think they're going to find out hanging around here. Jury selection starts today. They want to know how I feel. How do they think you feel? You want Victor to fry for killing Duke. Yeah, that's all we've got to prove he was involved. He will. That guy, Scott, can be a mean dude when he wants to be. We don't have any real evidence, though. Maybe Cindy will come up with something. Cindy? Who's Cindy? It's, it's uh, Malone's girlfriend. Oh, that's the agent who set up Duke, isn't it? Mm. Scott's going to bring her around here. Why? You want to talk to her? I, I don't I want to talk to her, but she thinks she's remembered something about Victor. Man, that's going to be kind of weird, isn't it? Her boyfriend killed your husband. Yeah, but she didn't have anything to do with it. Besides, my Robert killed her boyfriend. Mm. Oh, that reminds me, chum. Robert, has he called you from Los Angeles? No, he hasn't called. I'm kind of worried. You should have heard something about Catherine by now. All of those people. Robert, forget it. I've already been through it. There's got to be some clue around the summer as to where he's taking. Hey, 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 hey. Calm down a little bit. We, we, we have been through this room a thousand times. Look harder, will you? All right, we've... This thing's just... starting to drive me crazy. Look, I am just as concerned as you are about the safety of Catherine, but I... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to blow up at you. Look, whoa, 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 whoa. Just a sec. Just a sec. If it makes you feel any better, I know exactly what you've been going through. I mean, they... they and every time I think of that guy with her... Well, oh, let's think man. positive, okay? Come on. Yeah, come in. What do you got? Sorry, Commissioner. No sign yet of that van DeVore rented. What about the APBs? We're still checking. All right, listen, get on the phone. Have your reports called in over here. I want to see what kind of progress you're making. You know, it's like this guy, DeVore, just, he disappeared into thin air. Well, he didn't. And he's out there somewhere. And he's with her.
that way. the smiles on both your faces, I'd say it is a beautiful day. <laughs> Finally. I was getting worried about you two. Yeah, well, things have been a little bit crazy lately. But that'll change, won't it? Absolutely, and for the better. Right. I am glad to hear it. Now, what'll you have? I think I'll just have some coffee. I can't stay very long. Before you go, I want to talk to you. Uh, let's just go sit over here. And Ruby, I'm expecting Karen Kennedy. So if she walks in, I'll bring her over. Thank you very much. There you go, sweetheart. Thank you. Karen Kennedy, isn't that the lawyer who's helping you divorce Ariel? Yeah, well, I hope so. Hmm. Well, there's got to be some other way other than going through the Greek authorities because that's such a long and complicated process. Well, Karen told me that she thought she had another way figured out. Good. I want she's single. I just can't believe that I'm married at all. This whole thing has been such an incredible nightmare. It doesn't even seem real. You know when the first time is that it started to sink in? When Sean came back from the WSB and said that the marriage certificate was a legal and binding document. No matter what happens, I love you. I'm going to make it up to you. I just want to be Mrs. Colton Shore, the only Mrs. Colton Shore. That's going to happen. We're going to make it happen. Okay? Do you want to wait with me for Karen? Uh, no, I, I can't. I have a hundred things that I have to do today. I'm, uh, I'm going to go pick up Tony and take him to the hospital, and then I meet Bobby today. We're going to talk about Simone's baby shower. Ooh, baby shower. Boy, I must be excited, huh? Yeah, yeah. Oh, and then I have to go over to the office today and see if Sean faxed anything in from L.A. No word yet on whether Robert found Catherine? No. And don't forget, we have to go to the courthouse today. <clears throat> and as... They're, they're finding out who's going to be on the jury for Victor Drum's trial. Yeah, I didn't forget. I'm all dressed, ready to go. Yeah. You are busy today, aren't you? Yeah, there's something else I've been thinking about, too. I've decided I'm not going to let anybody run my life anymore and make my own decisions from now on. I'm with you. Positive thinking from here on out. Positive thinking. So what are you going to do after you leave Karen? Well, I thought maybe I would go and pick you up and um, we could just go somewhere and I would hold you in my arms all afternoon. And then I'd make love to you all night long. And then... <laughs> okay, okay, you're right. I'm sorry. First things first, right? Get a divorce. Get a divorce, yeah. That's all I'm going to be thinking about. I swear. Oh, well, you, you could do one other thing. What's that? You think about me every now and then. Think about you? Mm, every now and then. Oh, okay. Just every now and then. Okay. <coughs> oh, I'm uh, sorry. Miss Kennedy. We were just... Uh, oh. thanks, Hello, Ruby. my name is Hi. Lisa Jones. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'll well, see you later. Okay, honey. I'll pick you up and then we'll go over to Anna's, all right? Okay. All right. Huh? Goodbye, Please, Susan. have a seat. All right, Karen, so tell me, how am I going to get this divorce? 